Over the Thanksgiving weekend, doctors at East Tennessee Children's Hospital say they saw close to 50 RSV cases. And I anticipate that number will just continue to keep rising, and I think year, uh, year to date so far we are close to 170. Doctors say RSV is a scary virus and can be deadly. And last year we had a really bad RSV season. We had several patients that ended up in the intensive care unit um, due to that illness. Newborns, infants, and babies with weakened immune systems are at highest risk for RSV. They have tiny passages in general, so their noses are teeny little tiny and they breathe through their nose, first of all. So when they get just a little bit of congestion, that makes everything more difficult. Sleeping is more difficult, eating is more difficult because they can't breathe through their nose and they haven't yet learned to breathe through their mouth. And then on top of that, little ones have a lot tinier breathing tubes than we do. Doctors say babies who have the infection will lose their appetite, have a runny nose and a cough. Really working to breathe, their belly goes up and down, they'll pull in right here, they'll be pulling in between their ribs. It's why today they're stressing everyone, take care of little ones by washing your hands, not touching your eyes, nose or mouth, Cover your coughs and sneezes. Clean and disinfect your home and stay home if you're sick. Don't kiss the babies. Don't love on the babies if you got any kind of runny nose, cough, congestion, anything like that. And as a mom, absolutely feel empowered to say, hey, if you're sick, you have respiratory symptoms, please do not come near the baby.